East Feld, Osteria, and today we are talking about zucchini blossoms. So what exactly is a zucchini blossom for the uninitiated? It is the zucchini flower. When the zucchini grows and it's still small, first it develops a flower and then on the way to become a large zucchini. And so for people who look at that and they say, well, like, I can't eat flowers or I don't want to eat flowers, you know, what is the benefit and what's the taste of a zucchini blossom? It picks up the entire flavor of the zucchini of the, when it's still small and then of the basically when it blossoms and then it's really way more flavorful even than it's zucchini itself. And so obviously they're very delicate. You know, when you're cooking a zucchini, you can chop them, you can throw them in anything, but with the blossoms, you could, you know, really crush them if you're not handling them properly. So how do you recommend handling them? Of course you need to treat them the least possible. That means when you deep fry them, just make sure you have extremely fresh oil and fry them really quick. Are there other ways to cook them as well? How else can you, you use can, them? You can use them, like uh, even just toss them in the sauce with pastas. Uh, and it flavorizes the, the pasta really well, or you can even eat, eat it raw, marinated in salads. Mm -hmm. They just add flavor. Do you often see them whole just because they look the most beautiful whole? I like them whole, so yeah. you really see the real flower. Actually, it's even more appealing. You see the, the beautiful orange color going down to the green. Mm -hmm. It's beautiful. So you're going to show us how to make your fried zucchini sure. blossoms. Will you show us the steps? Sure. Okay, so now we are in the kitchen and we are going to make our signature crispy stuffed zucchini flowers. The first step, I'm stuffing them with some sheep ricotta. It's extremely fresh tasting. Here I have a mix of flour, which is a double zero flour, cornstarch and uh, sparkling water. It helps to make it more bubbly, it gets more crispy. I dip it in, not too much. As you can see, it's a very liquid mixture. Deep fry it, it's just a regular canola oil, frying oil. Approximately 40 seconds each side. It cannot get any color, it needs to stay white and nice and clear. So you see the color of the zucchini flour on, and in the same time it must be cooked and it must be crispy. And they are ready. Thanks for watching, these are the fried zucchini flowers from East Australia. Mm -hmm.